What's going on everybody? Welcome back to another tech tip and in today's video I'm going to show you how to transfer your music from your phone or to your computer. Check it out. So first things first, before we go on over to the computer and actually show you how the transfer process is done, we're going to need one of two or we're going to need two of two things. First is of course the phone that you're going to use to transfer the music back and forth. And then secondly, you're going to want to have a USB cable. This is make sure that the USB cable does support data transfer and charging capabilities. I know a lot of third-party cables do not allow you to do that. So it's best to just have the phone or the cable that came with the phone itself. Now you may be thinking, well, why don't you just use like Spotify or Google, Google Music or anything like that? And that is correct. There are applications out there that allow you to have cloud-based music. But in this particular video, we're just going to go over how to transfer or backup music via a USB connection. So first thing is, take one end of it, plug the USB into the computer. And then of course, the other end, plug that into your phone. Now if you do have like a pattern or password or pin number, you will need to unlock the phone. So make sure that the phone is unlocked. You may also get a prompt on that phone and transfer that information back and forth. So what we're going to do is we're going to go on over to the computer and I'm actually show you how to back up that information. As you can see, we're going to open up just any file explorer window. So we're just going to open up the generic one and you'll notice on here, I've got a device icon that says Aaron's S8. That indicates that the computer is talking to my phone. We're going to double left click on it. And this is where you'll kind of want to determine where your music is actually saved. In my particular case, I have my music saved on an internal storage on the phone, whereas you may have it on your card if you do have an SD expansion slot. So we're going to left click on phone in this case. So I'm going to go ahead and left click on my music folder. And you'll notice I've got six files in here that I would like to back up onto the computer. So there's a few different methods you can do this. You can left click and hold and it will select all of them. You can hit control A, which will select all of them. Or if you wanted to select or individually select them, you can hold down control and then left click on individual files and that will select them individually. And then you can drag them and drop them to your music folder wherever you decide that you want to back this information up. So I'm just gonna do control A, We'll back them up over here and then you'll notice a little transfer bar come up basically saying that it's copying to the actual computer. So say that you've got music on your computer but you want to put them on your phone. Same steps, just in a reverse order. So what we're gonna do, open up wherever you have your music at. Now this could be a little bit tricky if you have them separated into different artist files or different uh, genre files or album files, things like that. So you'll want to kind of put together a basically, I guess, a playlist, if you will, that you want to transfer over to your phone. Um, unless your phone is large enough, the, the space on your phone is large enough that it will select the whole thing, then you can copy and paste them all. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna, again, open up the Aaron's S8, go into phone, go into music, and then I'm also gonna open up my music backup folder, which is right here on the desktop. Yours may differ. And you'll notice another window will pop up. I'm just gonna left click and hold, which will highlight, drag and highlight all of them and then I'm going to drag them to the music folder on the phone itself. As you'll notice, a copy bar came across. Everything's copied on there. Now what you'll want to do is just make sure that your phone has some type, some type of application that allows you to play music files. Most phones, uh, especially Android phones, will usually have Google Play as the default um, audio device app, or you may need to go into the Play Store and download an app so you can be able to play your music. Pretty straightforward process on transferring your music from your phone to your computer or vice versa with the USB cable. Don't forget to leave any kind of comment or feedback in the comment section below the video. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up, share the video, and just a quick question of the day before you go, what type of transfer methods do you use? Again, leave that information down below. We will see you next time.